Here we go. The 2014 champion of the world yeah. on Baby Flo. Well, congratulations. Congratulations. World champion. What's up, Flomies? I am so excited to finally put a bow on this journey. Now we're almost ready, but for what? Well, the Retired Racehorse Project. That's what I've been working on with my thoroughbred cowboy swagger, originally from Oregon. Shout out to all the people that helped me get, get him to Texas. I'm super excited to take you guys through this journey of such an incredible horse. Now we are confident, we're excited, and we're super pumped to show off our talents at the Retired Racehorse Project, which is going to be happening in Lexington, Kentucky, where they have the Kentucky Derby. So I'm really excited. I wanted to go to the Kentucky Derby always. I've never made the time in my schedule to do it. So I'm going to be going a different way. And that is taking Cowboy Swagger to show off our talents and all of our progress at the Retired Racehorse Project. Now, a lot of these horses are going to be auctioned off after their training at the Retired Racehorse Project. Cowboy Swagger is not. We'll be finding him a new home afterwards, which we'll figure that out much later. Um, but these horses are incredible creatures and the Retired Racehorse Project is just set up to bring awareness to these horses that don't really have a whole lot of places to go after their race career. So we watch them on TV, they win thousands of dollars, and then what happens to them? Well, most of the time, um, they're not given a proper chance to be a performance athlete, so they get a lot of us trainers to all come together and showcase our talents that we have in each discipline, whether it be dressage or um, hunter jumpers or even ranch work and barrel racing, and allow us to compete for $100,000 together to showcase what we can do with these amazing animals. So I'm gonna show you what I've been able to do thus far with Cowboy Swagger. Now it hasn't been smooth. Thoroughbreds are not perfect candidates for running barrels because they're primarily made to run straight and for very long distances. So while they're not a perfect candidate, that doesn't mean that they can't do it. So I wanna show you how much talent this horse has and how much he loves running barrels. And I can't wait to go compete in Kentucky because this horse is so special and hopefully can potentially win fan favorite from you. Hopefully you'll fall in love with him just like we have. Check it out.
hope you guys use my journey to encourage yourself because it was darn sure full of flaws. At times I thought we would never make it to actually leave to go to Kentucky, but we are ready. We're prepared and we feel great. So if you have something that you've been trying to go after and you've hit roadblock after roadblock, just know if you believe in something and you have one of these magical animals in your barn that you really, really, truly believe in, really amazing things can happen. We'll hope if we get the chance to get the fan vote that you'll vote for us, but first, We've got to go win this thing. So please wish us luck. Our outfits are ready. See Money has hooked it up and I can't wait to show you what I'll be wearing. You guys, if you're not already subscribed, make sure to be subscribed, ding the notification bell. And as always, don't forget to count your blessings, drink your protein and say thank you to Jesus. See you in Kentucky.